learning objectives. After completing this module, learners will be able to explain why we study history, list the fertile regions where people mostly live, discuss the reasons for people moving from one place to another, explain that people also crossed barriers to settle in India, list different ways to know about past, describe the meaning of dates BC and AD. What and where? What can we know about the past? History is the study of people and happenings of the past in a chronological order. Studying history helps us to find out about the food, clothes and houses of different people in the past. Basically, history tells us about the ancient culture and lifestyle. Where did people live? People have lived near river valleys. This was because rivers provided water for all purposes. For example, Narmada River provided water for several purposes on its banks. Such areas had vast wealth of resources in the form of forests and animals. Wheat and barley were the first crops grown at Suleiman and Kirthar hills in the northwest. Garo hills and Vindhyas had a rich agricultural expanse. Rice was first grown at the north of the Vindhyas. Cities were developed on the banks of the Ganga River and its tributaries. In ancient times, the area along the south of the Ganga was known as Magadha. Its rulers set up a large and powerful kingdom. Kingdoms were set up in other parts of the country as well. Throughout, people moved mainly in search of food and other basic needs and also to escape from natural calamities such as floods and droughts. Some people travelled for adventure and to discover new places. Such movements helped to exchange customs and traditions. Hills, mountains and seas acted as natural barriers for India. People crossed these barriers to come and settle in India. This led to people of different customs and traditions live at one place. How? Deriving the name India Our country is generally known by two names, India and Bharat. The word India comes from the Indus River. The Iranians and the Greeks called the Indus as the Hindus or the Indos. Thus, the land of the east of this river was called India. The name Bharat was used in the Rig Veda for a group of people that later became the name of our country. Finding about the past The different ways to know about past are through manuscripts, these are the books that were written long ago by hand. These were usually written on palm leaves or barks of the birch tree. Manuscripts had writing on religious beliefs and practices. The life of kings, medicines, signs, epics, poems and plays. Through inscriptions. These are writings on hard surfaces, such as stone or metal. Writings could be related to kings, orders and their works. Through archaeologists, studying things like historical buildings, paintings, sculptures, tools, weapons, pots, ornaments and coins used in the past helps us to know about history. Those who study such things are called archaeologists. Through historians, historians are people who study and write about happenings and people of the past. They do different kinds of research on the people in the past and happenings of their lives. When is past one or many? 
past can be different for different groups of people lives of one group of people belonging to one profession were different from the other for example the lives of the gatherers or farmers were different from those of kings and queens such differences that existed in the past exist even in the present time people followed different practices and customs in different parts of the country this exists even in the present time in remote areas most people gather their own food on the contrary people living in cities depend on other sources for food supplies kings kept a record of their lives and victories in the battles they fought but ordinary people such as hunters fishermen gatherers and farmers did not follow the same archaeologists help us to find out about their lives but still there is much that remains unknown what do dates mean when you mention the year as 2018 it means 2018 years after the birth of jesus christ the founder of christianity the birth of jesus christ is marked as the first date all the years are counted from that day all dates before the birth of christ are counted backwards and usually have the letters bc or before christ after it You will also find AD Anno Domini before dates. AD means in the year of the Lord, that is Christ. So 2018 can also be written as AD 2018. Summary. Let us summarize what we have learned. History tell us about the ancient culture and lifestyle. people lived near river valleys because rivers provided water for all purposes people moved mainly in search of food and to escape from natural disasters like floods or droughts people crossed barriers like hills mountains and seas to come and settle in india our country is generally known by two names india and bharat The different ways to know about past are through manuscripts, inscriptions, archaeologists, and historians. People followed different practices and customs in different parts of the country in the past.